inside Alumni Arena as the Bulls have just completed quite the comeback against the Canisius Golden Griffins. We're now joined by head coach Lipsedge. Coach, first let's talk about, before we get to this game, I know this is what we want to talk about, let's talk about this morning's match against Hampton first. Mm -hmm. uh, come away with two wins today. Great for the first match against Hampton. You were able yeah. to just put your foot down and, and, and come away with a 3-0 win. Yeah, what I really liked about that is that we started off kind of shaky and nervous, jitters, you know, the first match of the of the season. And then they really came into their own in the third set. And I think that kind of helped us and brought us along into this match today. Who stood out to you in that first match of someone who uh, played, you know, maybe not someone, you know, I know you expect everyone to play well, but Always. someone who really stepped up and played, you know, above your expectations, maybe. I think Lara. Our libero was just unbelievable. She kept us in system. She kept us great. I mean, passing-wise, she was wonderful, and defensively, she was everywhere. And, and so let's talk about the two different ways that you won today. The yeah. end goal is two wins, but you run through the first the first match. The second right. one, you have to fight back and win yeah. three in a row. As a coach, um, maybe break down each win. What that mm -hmm. tells you about the group you have early on in the season? I, this is what you want in preseason, really. You know, you want to be able to have a lot of different teams and a a lot of different up balance out there on the court, and I think we, they did a good job of everyone kind of being leaders today, and that's what we've been looking for all preseason. They've really stepped up. All right, let's get into this match. We just saw the Canisius one. You fall down two nothing. What's the yeah. sentiment to the team right after you, you know you go down two nothing? Mm -hmm. What are you telling the, t the players in the huddle? Well, in those first two sets, I think we gave them a lot of points. You know, we had a lot of errors on our side, and it was just them recognizing. You know, we're giving them a lot of errors, so then what can we do if we don't? And, and I know I want to point this out, Amy. Uh, I know we talked about this all game, but Polina Prokadina yeah. was unbelievable mm -hmm. out there tonight. She's awesome to watch yeah. as we're going to see some highlights from her. Uh, you know, you got to be thrilled with the way she's come right into this team and stepped up. She has, and she's the best teammate. She's just amazing to have in our gym. I think she brings up the level, but she also brings so many other things to the table, and we've just, she's been a joy to have. And we were joking, the, the new hashtag on the shirt is McLaren to Procadina because yeah. you can tell that they really, she's a fun yeah. target to set to. Mm -hmm. uh, and what do you see in terms of, they're both sophomores. Um, how, what, where are they now to harp mm -hmm. out how far they can be? You're the volleyball yeah. expert, so I mean, we're so excited watching them. Yeah. How much better can they get? I can't wait to see how much they grow. But you know, we're always focused on the next day and the next match and the next practice. And I think that's what's so great about both of them is they are, they're there for the grind. One more before I let you go. Uh, you know, falling down 2 nothing and the yeah. team fighting back. Yeah. It's early in the season, but it's got to tell you something about the squad you got, that they're not just going to take a punch in the gut and lay down. They got right back up and, and fought back. That's got to be really heartwarming as a coach. Definitely. I mean, we've been working on that grind of practice every single day, and they really had a breakthrough earlier this week, and I think we saw it. And as we see one more highlight package here from Andrea Mitrovic, 22 kills and 12 digs, another just player who stepped up big as a freshman came right into your team, right into your system, and is already producing this early. Yeah, we knew that she would have a really big impact right away, and she's definitely proven that. Um, she's hitting at a, at a level that is very impressive, but I'm also impressed by her serve-receive and defense. She stepped up all over the place. That'll do it for us tonight in Alumni Arena as the Bulls come away with a huge comeback victory, their second of the day. Coach, thank you very much, and congratulations. Alongside Amy Otterberg, I'm Matt Mattia. That'll do us. You've been watching ESPN Women's College Volleyball on ESPN.